Hey babes, welcome back to my channel. So jumping right in, I'm going to be taking this Photo Loving Studio Perfect Primer from NYX, and that's what I'm going to be using as a base for my makeup. For foundation, I'm going to be taking the Maybelline, Maybelline, wow, Maybelline Better Skin Foundation, and this is what I'm going to be applying all over my face. I'm gonna first apply the product with my finger, and then I'm going to be taking a brush from Lottie London. This is a stippling brush, and that's what I'm going to be using to buff that into my skin. I'm gonna start just by dabbing it in, and then I'm just going to swirl it around in buffing motions. For my eyebrows, I'm going to be taking the NYX Micro Brow Pencil. This is in the color Espresso, and this is what I'm going to be using to fill in my brows. I'm just gonna first buff my hairs up and make sure they're sticking in the place that I want, and then I'm just going to fill in my brows. I really love this product. It's really great, and it's only like six bucks. Now I'm going to highlight my face, and I'm going to be using the Black Opal Foundation Stick. This is in the color Almond. I'm just going to be placing this all over in the areas where I would normally apply um, my highlighting concealer. I really love this product for this. It makes it really easy to apply, and it blends really nicely. I'm just using the same brush that I used to blend my foundation for this. So after that's all blended in, I'm going to be going in with this L'Oreal True Match Powder. I remember in my last drugstore tutorial, I was looking for a powder. I absolutely love this drugstore powder. It's really, really effortlessly beautiful on the skin. And to apply this, I'm using another brush from Lottie London. This is just the buffing powder brush. I also really love Lottie London brushes. They're super affordable and they apply product really nicely. So now I'm going to be taking this contour kit from NYX and I'm going to be taking the yellow yellow wow the yellow banana powder shade and this brush that I got from Walmart a really long time ago also really affordable and I'm just placing that all over the places where I applied that lighter foundation and then going back in with a buffing brush and blending it out to contour and highlight I'm going to be taking the black radiance true complexion contour kit first I'm going to take the darkest shade and I'm going to be using this brush from BH cosmetics which I think is about seven dollars and I'm just going to be tapping that into the areas where I normally contour and then sweeping it in blending upward you always want to remember to blend your contour upward also I apologize that my hair is an absolute wreck this entire video I don't understand really why that is I just guess I didn't try prior to filming this video but I just went in with that highlighter shade and just place that in the areas where I would normally highlight I put some on my cheekbones I'm applying it on my nose I'm gonna apply that on my inner tear duct and I'm also going to be applying that in the center of my eye okay so here I'm going to be taking this blush color from this NYX um, eyeshadow and blush palette but it doesn't really show up that much so you'll see later in the video I'm also going to be adding a different blush and then I'm just going back in and blending my contour in with that blush now I'm going to be moving on to the lips. I skipped the uh, mascara for this video because I don't have a drugstore mascara. I need one. If you have one, please leave it down in the comments below. But I'm using this um, NYX lip pencil. I believe this is in the color just brown. And I'm lining my lips with this. And then I'm taking this NYX soft matte lip cream. I don't know the name of this, but I will link it down below. And that's what I'm using to apply on my lips. This color really, really works. I love this color combination a lot. You guys know I'm obsessed with nude lips. I don't know what my obsession is or if I'll ever get over it, but if I can find an affordable nude lip, that's the route that I'm going to take. So now I'm going to be taking this Lorac blush, and no, this is not a drugstore blush. This is literally all I had in my kit at the moment, and I, I went a little crazy with that. So I'm taking this BH Cosmetics brush. I believe this brush is maybe 7 or $8, and I'm just going to blend that out all over my face. Okay, so now we're going to fix this mess that I'm calling hair on my head. I'm taking the Living Proof Perfect Hair Day 5-in-1 Styling Treatment, and this is not a drugstore product, but it does come in your glam bag, which is really affordable. And the way it works is you just apply it to your hair while it's still damp, and it prevents your hair, well, it protects it from heat damage, and it also makes your hairstyle last a little bit longer. So I just apply a little bit of that and then straighten my hair. I hope that you guys love this really short, quick, to the point video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and comment down below and let me know other videos you'd like to see. Also, check out my last video if you haven't already. I love you so much and I'll see you next time. Bye!